Tor, green jersey still as the sprinter, but how does the God of Thunder go in the mountains? Oh, he's suffering. <laughs> <laughs> no, it, uh, it, yeah, it's, uh, it was a hard uh, day in the Alps today, so uh, no, I was suffering, of course, in the big mountains, but uh, I survived and uh, yeah, it's, it's, it was not too bad. We spoke to Robin McKeown before the start and he spoke about the percentages and working out the, the average speeds of the bunch. Had a card in his pocket with the percentages and, and time that he would be able to lose. Did you guys talk about that during the race and how much uh, of thought do you put into you know the percentages and time lost for the stage to make sure you come in the time limit? Yeah, of course, we, we always think about it. Uh, we, we count the minutes, minutes from the, the, the first group and then the peloton and then the average speed of the... Of, uh, of the peloton and uh, of course and how much time he can lose in heavy mountains so uh, with the experience we all have and especially Robin McEwen he's an experienced guy in this game now so uh, uh, then it's, uh, it's no problem. Look, I know it's tough out there obviously for the sprinters and you're not a pure sprinter, you're much more of a strong man sort of guy I guess but what do you do to pass the time in, in the group Beto? Much chit chat, talking away, telling some stories? Uh, well, actually we suffer a lot so uh, He's more sharing about uh, this, uh, this, this rider go too fast and uh, this rider is uh, doing this and this. Uh, now we have a laugh now and then and uh, some talks, but uh, we, we suffer a lot out there. Oh, well, your day is coming very soon again, so good luck for the green jersey. Thank you very much.